There are reports <laughs> that Daniel Andrews in Victoria has been questioned by IBAC over Labor Party culture. There's a surprise. Mm. Here's what he had to say about it. I'm not making any comments about these matters and for a third time, let me make it very clear to you that I'm not making any comments, sorry, I'm not making any comments on these matters. I will not be making any comments about these matters. I will not be commenting on any of these matters or matters that are related to them. I'm not going to speak about any of these matters. Till then, I will not be talking about them. I'm not speaking about these matters. I'm not commenting on these matters. At the end of the day, I'm not commenting on these matters. I am not going to uh, be commenting on these matters. Again, I'm not commenting one way or the other. Jenna, do you think he's going to say anything about these matters, firstly? And secondly, he survived everything else. Could this actually bring down the Andrews government? No, I think he's a lot like McGowan in WA. I think yeah, there are a very loud minority that probably want Andrews gone, but I think he has the Midas touch when it comes to the way that he conducts himself publicly uh, to, to the regular sort of punter. But I feel that these IBAC claims are like political indigestion for the Labor Party in Victoria because they just keep rising to the surface. So he either has to play that bat and refuse to comment moving forward or he has to just tackle them head on. And I think as we've seen with every Every other little palaver that's happened when it comes to Daniel Andrews and the Victorian Labor Party, I think he's just going to ignore it and move on.